Hello everybody, Brad here today. Welcome to City Skylines. Today I'm going to show you how you can use the Metro Overhaul mod, M-O-M, -M, into your City Skylines game. So what I'm going to do is I'll show you piece by piece what you need. So what you need to subscribe to on the workshop. We have a little demo here set up and in the distance there you can see a city. And we'll have a go uh, putting in a very very simple metro overhaul mod an overground metro system in place so what do you need for this to work you need the depot station and a station whether that be a train station or a metro station then what you need is track so there are lots of different types of station you can use so you can use a train station and if you're going to use a train station, what you need to do is say you want to use the base game train station. Yep, this one right here. Everyone knows what this one looks like. What you need to do is you need to go onto Metro Station Configuration and you want to say that you want to use this train station as a metro line. So that's base game. So now, overground metro trains like this one just here, if you connect it up, we'll be able to service at this station. Okay? You just need to remember to go onto this metro station configuration. It's something that I always forget to do. I always have to demolish mine and restart. So make sure it's on metro station configuration, not train station, not default. Obviously the metro stations by default will be on metro, so you haven't got to change them. But train stations you have to change. There's lots of different styles. You can have the base game. Here's like a, a um, sort of on the floor station with an overpass that's quite nice here we've got like a new york themed station and here we've got an overground station okay and here these are the types of tracks you'll find the track in the metro tab so here you have it so you have single metro track which is this one here and you can have the wide pillar version you can say you want it to be over the road friendly so this track here is over road friendly look it's going over the road beneath it my game's just saving that. You have double tracks, so dual metro track, which is this one just here. And then you have the quad metro track. So this one can have a, it's a four lane metro, so you can have four metros passing each other on here at a time. And of course, the really important feature is you need to have a metropolitan depot and you need to set up a route, obviously. Okay. So over here, what we've got is the depot. We've got the single tracks, so you can have two metros passing each other at a time. Coming up here to the New York station. This is the train here, you can get different trains on the workshop as well. And there's a simple service that goes from this station over to this one. Simple as that. As easy as that. If we follow, no, nope, want to follow that just for a sec. So this is this is called the Metropolitan Local Train. So it looks like a graffiti, worn out type of train, and I really like this one. That's quite a nice one. Okay, so that's I just want to show you it running there. You need the depot. That's one of the big points. Okay. So what I thought we could do is I thought we could go over to our very quickly built city. It took me about a few minutes to make it. Very very basic, very simple, and I'll show you how to start one from scratch. Just a note here, please make sure you, ha you have subscribed to every single item you need for the mod to work. I will put all of the mods you need in a folder and I'll link them down below in this video so you can just subscribe to that folder and not worry about it. Also, please make sure you've turned the mods on. If you don't know how to do that, then I will show you right now how to do that. To make sure you have the mods turned on, what you need to do is on the main menu, go to Content Manager, go to Mods, and you want to make sure that all of these are on. Be careful, if you sort by Author, you'll have the default mods here. So I'm going to turn on Unlimited Money so we can build some stations in-game. I always have Hard Mode off personally, but you always want basically everything else on. Okay? So you want to make sure you want to go down and make sure that everything's on. Let's try and find like train converter. That's one that you need to match your overhaul. You want to make sure that all of these mods are turned on. If you have any which are off, it will not work. Okay, make sure they are on. Okay, we've got our metropolitan depot into our city, our very small city. Now what we want to do to get our metro service running is we need to put in some train stations. 
So like I said, you could go with the normal standard metro stations or you could go with these, which are train stations that we're going to put down as metro stations, if that makes sense. So let's go with ground station. This is what you need to You need to click this metro station configuration, okay? And we'll just pop those down, one there, and I'll put another one on the other side. Then you go back to your metro, take some track. So we're going to go, we'll go let's go single metro. Actually, let's go double. Let's treat ourselves. And we want to connect this up to our depot. It has to be connected to our depot. We've not got to connect that one up to, a, to the depot. We've just got to connect one station up to the depot, okay? So let's go from here. I was going to snake around. It doesn't matter what side you go, onto one of those. Then here, we're going to go, we want to say, keep on the floor. And we're going to go there. Okay. Please excuse my building, I do not normally build like this, this is just for the purpose of the video. Out to there. That is now a functioning metro. What we need to do now is place in our route. So we want to say our route goes from here to here, back to there. Very, very simple route. I'm going to pause there and I'm going to select my train. So you click on the route, select type, and we want to say what train we want. Let's get our, what's this, Brooklyn Shuttle. Let's get two of those trains down. Now you should see some trains spawning from this depot. Here we go. So this is our Brooklyn train. Let's follow this. So it's going to stop at this station just here. Like that. It will stop. Look at the graffiti. The graffiti looks really cool, doesn't it? And now it's going to go all the way over to our other station and also stop there. That's how simple it is, guys, to build a functioning overground metro. You can do all sorts of stuff with this. You can mix your train stations, like these ones we have here, with metro stations. You can get this kind of metro going through the city. I did make a series, my first City Skyline series. We did put in some metro stations, some overground metro. So I will link that video now. And please feel free to go and have a look, see how we built the metro in that city. I hope this helps, guys. Please comment down below if it has helped. I want to hear, you know, how you're finding it. Has it made your city more realistic? Has it made public transport for your sims a lot easier? Let me know if it doesn't work, okay? I will try my harder to try and help you if it doesn't work. The main two things are to remember, to make sure you subscribe to all of the required items on the workshop and to make sure you have all of these mods turned on, okay? So I really, I really hope that's helped, guys. I'll see you again soon. See you later. If you like the video, please give it a like, subscribe to the channel, post a comment down below, and please follow me on Facebook and Twitter to keep updated. See you later.